there's something about the culture now where um, it's it's not just I disagree with the speaker. It's this speaker needs to be eliminated. They yeah. should not have a have a platform. It's it's not the screw that guy. I'm going to go on with my own life. It's no, you are wrong, and therefore I'm going to effectively try to destroy you. And you know you see you see that happening now, where like you said, you'll you'll have you know conservatives calling for Bill Maher's you know t- to be fired, uh, or you know there, there was that dust up when he used the N word uh, on it, and I think people on the left were calling him for him to lose a job, and then you had people on the right saying, hey, you know what, he should because uh, you know uh, you reap what you sow, um, and. That's a really it, it's a really troubling thing because obviously it's going to be used against you at uh, at some point, and you, you, I, I've seen like a few instances uh, uh, recently of you know people who are working in stores who uh, are you know big time jerks to someone who comes in wearing a MAGA hat and either they curse at them they say the wrong thing and when those people get fired everyone applauds and. You know, I could I can understand why, you know, you'd want to see someone like that get fired. But there's got to be some room for people to make mistakes and to pay for their mistakes and go on and live, live their life. And it's so, it, I, I just feel like there's absolutely no forgiveness now. And and maybe this is just my way of saying, like, please forgive me for everything that I've ever done. Yeah, I really, yeah. Just start with me. 